The Central Election Commission announced on Tuesday that 9.61 million votes will be needed for the proposed constitutional amendment to lower the voting age in Taiwan from 20 to 18 years old to pass. Taipei Mayor Ko wen recently posted a video of his conversation with a senior high school student about the voting rights of 18-year-olds, showcasing a more relaxed and youthful tone. The Democratic Progressive Party also released a short film in an attempt to relate to young voters in a more emotional way. We can choose to change the way, to believe that things will be better. My father said, the clip depicts a young voter who is encouraged to make his own decision by his father. And as for the KMT, Kuomintang. Eighteen-year-old是全世界共同的趋势。台湾当然要同意。我希望我们尊重十八岁的年轻人，让所有十八岁的有公民权。the proposed constitutional amendment to lower the voting age in Taiwan to 18 years old will be one of the highlights of this year's 9-in-1 elections. While Taiwan's major political parties are in support of the proposal, it is still possible for it to fail, as it will require the support of a majority of the electorate. A proposed constitutional amendment requires over half of all eligible voters to cast a ballot in favor of the amendment in order to pass, which would be around 9.61 million votes this year. If it is passed, young Taiwanese people will not only have the right to vote in future elections and referendums starting at the age of 18, they will also be able to be elected to legislative bodies. As of now, Taiwan is the only Asian democracy where 18-year-olds cannot vote. Jennifer Dia, TVBS World Taiwan.